So let us now install the structure add-on. So let me first go to the manage add-on section. So if you go to the manage add-on section, you will be able to uh, take a look at all the add-ons that you can potentially install from the marketplace. So if you go to the option called find new add-ons, just type in here structure. And if you press the enter key, you will be presented with uh, all different options. Uh, basically, you have a few different structure add-ons that you can install. Now we have on top this add-on called structure for Jira projects at scale. Then we have structure dot pages for Jira and Confluence. Then we have structure dot Gantt hyphen planning at scale. So these are some additional modules that uh, our additional apps that you can uh, install along with your main structure add-on. So the so the main add-on that you need to install is this one on top. This is called Structure for Jira. And uh, let us now first install it using the evaluation uh, license. So since I've already installed this add-on, I uninstalled it, but I have this option to click on buy now, but uh, you might have the option to click on install. So if I click on this option called buy now, it will first install the add-on and then it will ask me to enter my evaluation key or it will automatically get the key from the uh, marketplace. So let us now uh, wait for the installation to finish. So our installation of structure is now done and now it is asking us to install the add-on. So I can either click on this particular button to get the license. So let me click on it. Oh, since I have already installed this add-on, so I can uh, I can now go back to my manage add-on section and I'll probably uh, enter the evaluation key manually. So when you go to the manage add-on section, you will probably find your structure add-on uh, listed somewhere. So you can see here that uh, uh, this particular add-on is installed and it is valid uh, till 12th of February, which is uh, exactly, not exactly, but almost one month uh, from uh, from today's date, uh, because I installed this add-on, I believe uh, on 13th of January. That is why it, it is showing me as 12th of February. So after you install this add-on, you will notice that on top of your um, main navigation, you have this option called structure, and you have a couple of things that you can do here. You can uh, click on query, you can click on create structure. You have the option to manage all the structure boards that you have uh, already created. But if you click on the get started link, you will be presented with the option to visualize or organize your uh, your uh, your issues in Jira. So basically it is nothing but a guide. It is nothing but a place where you can read about this particular st structure add-on or app. So you can spend some time uh, understanding how this works. It is basically some information which is already there in the documentation. So if you want, you can give this particular page a quick look. It is in fact quite good because if you start from the beginning, it will uh, give you some introduction, then it will uh, uh, give you some ideas or some tips on how to use a structure board. So you have the option to uh, take a look at uh, how the structure board is organized and uh, what is the purpose of different buttons. So you can see here that uh, you have some, some instructions. Then you have uh, the option to read this uh, very simple guide, which is numbered, like uh, step number one is switch to double grade, or uh, step number two is search for issues, and, uh, and so on. So I recommend that you spend some time on this particular interface, and uh, once, you have, uh, once you have read the documentation, you can uh, start using the structure app by clicking this button called uh, create new structure. So in the next video, we will create a new structure board and then we will add some issues in that particular board.